the EVO wins out on a traditional microscope in two major areas. The first area, I think, has to be the fact that you have a screen rather than binoculars or a single ocular uh, to see your, your images. Uh, what that means is that two things. One is that you don't have to take off your glasses, somebody like me, or you don't have to uh, focus in on uh, the oculars to be able to look at the experiment that you're doing, look at the, the images that you're doing, and you can kind of come up to the microscope and go away from the microscope really easily. And in fact, other people can be nearby the microscope and be seeing the same exact image that you're seeing. The second major advantage, I think, over traditional microscopes that the EVOS has, and, and, th and this is even a bigger one, is the fact that you, it's a wide field scope. I use it for fluorescence. You're, you don't have to deal with a mercury lamp. And what that means for me is, again, a convenience of being able to access it any time I want. I can turn the switch on and off a hundred times in ten minutes because I forgot something or I, I didn't realize I needed to add another image to the image series or I had another experiment I needed to do. I just don't have to worry about uh, the mercury lamp and it being shut down for 15, 20 minutes. I can just turn the thing on and off as much as I can. So it's the, definitely the, the LED aspect uh, makes it convenient and everyday access 100, 100 times a day, no problem whatsoever. So it's the uh, LEDs, the, the avoidance of the mercury lamp together with the, the, uh, the screen right there instead of uh, binoculars or oculars to see your images. Definitely advantages over the traditional microscope.